I think your point on the how it's very hard to uh, have a it could, uh, almost organise your social life without a social network is a very good point because I think a lot of people have become almost really dependent on it. And also going back to a point that uh, changing your uh, privacy rules, uh, it can create a lot of problems with, uh, especially young people. Obviously, young uh, young people may not have the uh, the um, state of mind almost to be responsible for the photos they take, the things they say, and also the views they express. So, if you take, for example, me, like I, I use, um, I'm. Uh, I'm a constant Facebook user, also Twitter. So if you were to look at some of the things that I've been up to in the last few years, as like I've been going through college and university, some of the pictures you may um, see a maybe a, a different image of what you see here instead of me sitting there seat talking to you. You may see a totally different view. And I think. Uh, if you uh, control the privacy correctly, you can stop people getting the wrong idea about you. So the people who know who I am and know a lot about me, so my close friends know that it's not that's not the real me. It's just me having a good time and uh, having some time off from being a professional person, a young professional. So I think when it comes to the privacy, I think everyone just has to be mindful and also think about how. What, how the things they're doing affects their future. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. Um, okay, I, I want to go to the remote participation now. Uh, Kieran, <laughs> he just raised his eyebrows at me. Do we have any questions from the crowd? 